Hi, good morning. Uh, today we'll be learning about uh, the allotropic uh, forms of iron with the help of uh, the graph shown on the screen. So, on this graph, we have uh, uh, plotted the different temperatures and uh, uh, in the uh, y axis and the x axis, the time. Uh, is shown and uh, the different forms of ions are also mentioned so let's see uh, iron has got uh, uh, these following uh, three allotropic uh, allotropic forms of crystal at, at different temperatures as mentioned over here so the three uh, forms are uh, like alpha ion uh, gamma ion and uh, the uh, delta ion so uh, the alpha ion are of uh, two types uh, it occurs from normal temperature of 910 degrees celsius and uh, has got body centered uh, cubic uh, lactic crystals uh, so uh, let's see the two uh, different forms of alpha ion one is the ferromagnetic uh, alpha ion uh, which occurs from uh, normal temperature uh, to about seven uh, 770 uh, degrees Celsius and uh, the next one is the uh, paramagnetic alpha ion which occurs from uh, 770 degrees Celsius uh, to about 910 uh, degrees Celsius so these are the two forms of alpha ion and the next stage is the gamma ion and uh, this occurs from uh, the 910 uh, degree mark to about 1400 degree uh, Celsius and that is the gamma ion occurring uh, process or gamma ion point at this particular temperature and uh, it has got crystal structure of uh, phase centered uh, cubic lactics and from there that is 1400 degree uh, celsius to 1539 degrees celsius that is in molten state we have the delta ion and uh, the crystal structure is body centered uh, cubic lactic and uh, this is in molten state State. Uh, so uh, these are the uh, three uh, variants of uh, iron occurring in different temperatures the alpha iron gamma iron and the delta iron so I believe you got an idea about uh, the allotropic forms of iron and for more technical uh, uh, engineering videos you can visit my blog uh, that is www.techrexinfo.com or my youtube channel for more uh, technical uh, tutorial videos thanks for watching